You sit there and, and you dig it. And maybe you get up. And, and maybe you get up inside it. And maybe it reaches out and grabs you. And it's weird, man. Dealing with a thing could be a very beautiful experience. It could crack your brain. This one looks cool to me. They have Angelina. Yeah. Oh wait, this one too. What is this? What? Is this cool Pokemon one? Oh yeah, I know, right? Is it fat Pikachu like my Pikachu? Look, he's in the same freaking Pikachu kind of. So about there. <laughs> <laughs> Say you're talking about this cat. Say he's a musician, and he really makes it, you think? I mean, he's into something. He's free, and he swings. Then you say, that cat has got a loose wing. Because it's very important to work on your brains. Smash your brains, you know, crack them. Yeah? That's when it can start happening. All right, well, I just wanted to pop on here and say, so far, so good. It's been about an hour since I've had my COVID shot. I know a lot of people don't get um, reactions until like the night of or possibly the next day, but I just want to say so far so good. Probably the worst thing about it yet is just like my arms really um, sore and kind of like itchy feeling. Um, but I just went around and got some snacks and an iced coffee. 
for my roommate who's working in the espresso stand, which was awesome. And now I'm going to head back home. So hopefully I'll be able to like work on smart projects later. Um, if my, if I feel okay. Um, I feel like I've heard a lot of people say that the first one doesn't get you as bad as the second one. So hopefully I can still kind of work on some art projects later. Um, and maybe play some video games and stuff. I'm sorry. Is this guy's made me go? Or does the game know my name's Mika yet? I don't think they know that my name's Mika yet unless they know my... What the heck? So today is the DIY music video stream number two on Twitch. That's tonight at 8. It's like 3 o'clock right now. Um, last night I didn't do anything after my COVID shot. I pretty much like slept and just like watched TV all night and um, played some video games and that was perfect. But I definitely have a lot more to do today. Um, my like I don't even have a spot really right now like in my room that would look good for the stream and I need to go through and make sure all the music videos are in the playlist ready to go. I need to hype it. Um, so yeah, we got a lot to do today. I'm still like in bed head. Um, I'm feeling pretty good from the shot. I definitely was super tired last night and my arm's really sore today, but um, I'm actually feeling a lot better than I was expecting, so that's super good. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna eat some more food, watch some trash reality TV for a little bit um, as I'm like kind of getting ready for the day and then maybe we need to pick out like a cute outfit take a shower and get just like in the mindset of we're doing stuff today um so i just spent the last few hours cleaning my whole house just felt like i couldn't think straight till it didn't it wasn't gross but it just was gross everywhere so i'm taking the dog out now and then hopefully after this i'll be back to what we need to get done for today um i mean what what i did needed to happen so it's all good but uh, i always do this it's like the more things i need to do the like cleaner my damn house is We are about an hour away from the stream and to be honest with you guys, a lot of the technical work still needs to get done. But we got our streaming spot set up which visually is important and I've got a very technical setup. Um, you guys probably know I'm a very tech savvy person so let's take a look at what I've figured out for this. Okay so it is literally my laptop on a box on a bin. And then a pillow with a wall. And then a really cute alien stuffy and some Christmas lights. You know, need to have the lights. And then I actually do have a really cool little light thingy that I'll be turning on as well. Um, you really will only see like this much of this wall when I'm streaming, so it should be fine. Um, but you know, I don't, yes, I don't, it's very technical. We all strive for the best and I think I've nailed it. Okay, I think I have everything set. Um, I've got all the music videos and playlists ready to go um, in the order that I think is best. It kind of makes me feel like I'm making like a mix CD for someone, <laughs> which I really love. Um, so it should be about an hour long. I hyped it um, a few different places like on Facebook and my Instagram and stuff. I mean, I'm not really sure if we're really going to get anyone in there, but it's just kind of fun and I want to keep doing it and it's really fun to be able to like reach out to bands and ask them if they have music videos and if they want to share them and I don't know, just like a, a fun project and I think last time the most people we had in there there was like 10, maybe 8. Um, so it, I'm, I'm not too worried about it, but it will be fun. Um, 
So I got that already. Uh, I got the links for all the bands as well. So if like anyone is really digging one, they can check out their band camp, which like, man, if someone just went to someone's Instagram and give them a follow because of my stream, that feels like a win right there. Um, I don't have a mic still. I need to actually research mics and get one maybe even before this video is posted. We will see. Um, so I gotta get my headset that I use to play video games so I can use that. Um, so yeah, we still have about like half an hour till the stream is supposed to start. So I'm probably, uh, yeah, I'll try and get some clips of the stream or link it below or something. I'm not really sure how to do any of this. I'm seriously winging it and I think my internet is being really bad today. So we'll check in soon. Hopefully everything goes off without a hitch. So I don't know if you guys can tell, but it looks like I don't have my, it's like not seeing my camera anymore. Oh my god. I've drank in so much coffee and my hands are so shaky. Sorry for like the weird freaking angle. But like, so if I go here, edit team, webcam. Yeah, it says that I can't see my freaking camera. This would be a good time, I thought, just like while this is reloading to say. I bought some blue light glasses. And I'm pretty sure I bought the cheapest ones on the internet and they are just like <laughs> play glasses, I feel like. If I literally like do this to my computer screen, I don't, I don't really think there's a difference. So currently they're my placebo glasses. Very cute. Cool. I like the marble. I honestly wish I had glasses or like, I guess it's kind of like rude to say I wish I needed glasses, but do like them so I'm not truly complaining but if you're looking for blue light glasses don't buy the ones from Sheen. actually really fun <clears throat> I liked a lot of the songs that we had for this time last stream oh my god um last stream it was kind of just like more whatever was submitted and this time I kind of um I still used a lot of the stuff that um wasn't able to fit in the last one but I also was able to like reach out to bands and kind of like curate it a little more which was fun um I tried to keep them more upbeat and like dancey i really want to just do like a just dancey hip-hop one um but it's kind of like i don't know that many bands i'm i'm in the more of the like punk scene so it's it's fun to do that as well but i feel like with live streams like it'd be kind of fun to have like people dancing um i mentioned this in the live stream but like once it's safe and people are vaccinated my like true goal um is to have like project it Maybe in my like garage we can move all the gear out of the way and like project it on the wall and then have like my friends like dance in the stream instead of just like me here like trying to do a client work today. Sprout is here to be my design assistant today. Um, so is my cat, Optimus Prime. Yeah, honestly, it's kind of one of those days where I need to start with um, my notebook and figure out where I am at with a bunch of things, just cause like a lot of different things are going on right now. Like, look, this is Opti or Optimus Prime if we're being formal, that's her full name. I honestly was like having trouble starting so I thought maybe just turning the camera on and like venting for a second would be a good thing to do. Um, so yeah, let's pull out the notebook, figure out where we're at with what projects and kind of like what's... <clears throat> My brain just died. And figure out what projects need to get done first. I know there's like so many deadlines coming out so let's get to it. Okay, 
So the first project that we're going to start today is actually um, going to be label designs for different salad dressings for a local um, pizza restaurant, which I'm really excited for. Um, they are mostly done. I'm just doing kind of final touches for the sizing right now. We need to go through and get um, our like final mock-up ready. Um, and then the owner is going to print them out um, where she is because we can't really meet up right now until we're both vaccinated from COVID. Um, make sure they fit on the jars exactly um, how they want them and then we'll be able to do the designs for the other backs. Um, I'm still working on those but they don't need to be completely finalized until we check the sizing because I don't want to like finish them and then realize we need to like size up or down. Um, I like them so far. I'll show what they look like here. Hopefully I can show them. I'll show them anyways. No one no one watches this. Uh, I'll show them. So this is what I'm working with right now. I'll put that here. And I just want to go in and add um, like fun details to the back label. We kind of have this like chalkboard menu kind of vibe going right now within fun like hand done illustrations. Um, so yeah, I think I want to go in and just do some fun little details for the ingredients list on the back and then they should be ready to send to the print shop over where they live to try out. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get going on that. much much later now um it's like almost nine o'clock at night about and i am going to finish this latte that's cold because it's delicious and i don't plan on going to sleep anytime soon anyways so it's all right yeah it's still really good anyways even though it's cool but so I finished uh, the mock-up of the label, sent them to the printer, and then sent them to the person, uh, the client, so they know to pick them up. Um, and then I realized I hadn't done my dang taxes yet, and um, that was the next emergency star to-do list thing on my to-do list, so I actually just finished that, um, and now it's dark outside, but you know, it's freaking nice to, to cross stuff off to do this i am a chronic to-do list maker um i will i'm i will write things on my to-do list that i've already done just to cross them off and be like oh um it's my fucking hooray you gotta have your fucking hooray moments in your planners so that was mine um so i'm really glad i got that done <clears throat> i'm probably um I also had to like track a sticker package which was a little bit frustrating but um, I ordered a sticker um, which I'll put up here with a cute little globe um, and it's like a Jack Harlow lyric. I don't really know Jack Harlow but um, I hear this song on the radio and I'm driving all the time but he's a little globe saying I'm about to globe trot once they know a vaccine and I was supposed to get here like two weeks ago and it's just been like sitting in the UPS distrib distribution center here for so long and I've been trying to get a hold of them and I can't and I can't file a claim without sticker mules information so hopefully I get to the bottom of that I just wrote sticker mule or email to try and contact them so hopefully they get here soon um, all right y'all I don't have a big Etsy shop so um I get like a few orders maybe a week or like a handful of orders every couple of weeks so I usually just do like one at a time. Um, I love watching um, packaging and like ASMR videos where people are like doing like a hundred orders at once, which is crazy, but um, I got one today. So I thought we would kind of talk about that and a couple products to end out this video. So my most popular product on Etsy is this sticker here. I'll try and get a good, uh, 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 uh picture of it um 
It is of Hypodermic Sally, played by Sarah Paulson from American Horror Story Hotel, which is the fifth season. Um, it was an Inktober project, which is like, makes me especially happy that it's like my most popular Etsy thing. Um, I guess the American Horror Story stands just like need stickers and products and they're on there searching. So that's pretty cool. Um, so what this is for a lucky person who picked it out today and also like favorited my shop which was really nice so I'm gonna put this aside for them um when you order from my Etsy shop right now I have these prints as like my thank you it was originally for a show poster that we played on our tour we did like three four, three four years ago I don't even know how long we just went down like the west coast and back um it was for a tiny bar show we played in Eugene Oregon um which was probably our most like worst show on tour probably but I thought it deserved another life it's like a cowboy riding a skeleton kitty through the desert um and on the back it just gives you a little shout out and a thank you and it's where I write my little notes to people um I'm also going to send this person a new postcard print I have coming for my patrons patrons um on patreon just because I really like it it's my new spring postcard it's got this little illustration of, I guess it's kind of me um, meditating and listening to music in the springtime. Um, I was just over at my mom's house yesterday, which is kind of like a jungle, and I saw the spot that this was kind of like where I was imagining when I was drawing this. So I want to go over there and take some pictures of this in that spot. Um, so yeah, this will be going to them as well. And then the last thing um, I'm going to send to this person Normally I like to just throw in a few extra stickers, but I actually have something that I think they'll be kind of excited about and it'll be a surprise. Um, <clears throat> so this is a mistake, but I think they'll still think it's cool. I actually got laminate pens made of the Hypodermic Sally design, um, but I don't want to post them yet and kind of like sell them yet because I'm not really happy with the size. The design still looks cool, um, you can still definitely see the illustration, but the little bit of text that says Hypodermic Sally, like, must be a point for text. Um, I truly should have taken a ruler and double checked the sizing. I thought I went big enough, um, because I sized it up once, but I did not size it big enough. Um, as you can see, it'd be, like, cute, but, um, definitely want to go... A little bigger for it so I just thought this would be fun to throw in since we already got the sticker it's kind of like a little surprise so that'll be going to them as well um, I don't really have fancy packaging right now I'm just gonna put it in a cute envelope doodle on it and then put it in like a little protective um, plastic <clears throat> which I ordered when I first um, started my Etsy shop and I'm working through and I want to uh, transition to compostable mailers in the future um really like inspired by other small creators and you know growing creators on youtube who are really really great at sustainability um and so i'm learning a lot from them so i'm kind of just like working through what i have right now and then i'll figure out the next step once i get there so thank you so much for coming along on this april studio vlog it was a little bit um all over the place but this is the first vlog that i'm making so uh, you know, I'm inspired by the quote, fail faster, I guess. Just get out there and make a cringy video with my phone and my like weird backgrounds that are like not aesthetically pleasing. Um, I'm working on my bed because I need to clean my desk off and like kind of revamp it for um, my like new work style. Um, it worked for a while, but it's not really working for me anymore, so... Think of all of this as like the before and hopefully we can kind of go like hang out as I figure things out and make them a little better. So yeah, thanks for hanging out with me and I'll see y'all next time. All right, bye. Y'all, I just wanted to pop back in here to say, I didn't realize that this is so cool. My this Etsy package is going to Australia. I freaking love that. Um, I really want to make like a one of those maps that you like color in when you send people stuff um the american horror story fans are everywhere i've sold stuff or i've sold this um hypodermic sally sticker like 
Australia, Germany, the UK. Um, that's awesome. I love looking up um, like the cities that it's going to and just kind of like imagining some of my stuff plastered up. So yeah, they might get another sticker because Australia needs some Mika art just like on a wall somewhere. That would be so dope. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to say that. Okay, bye again. See ya. You sit there and you dig it. And maybe you get up. And maybe you get up inside it. And maybe it reaches out and grabs you. And it's weird, man.